guys welcome back okay so today i'm going to be opening up one of my boxy charm boxes um i've only received one so far and by the size of it i'm thinking that this is my premium i'm pretty sure this is my premium box and looking at it you guys this box look like <laughs> like it done been through war it's beat up i'm actually scared to open this because if there's anything fragile in here it might be broke but anyway i'm gonna go ahead and open up my boxy charm premium today my base box has not arrived yet if it arrives tomorrow then i guess i'll just be doing another video because i'm tired of looking at it i want to open it and see what's in it now full disclosure i'm not really excited about opening my boxes like i have been in the past only because I don't know. It's just the items that I've been getting lately have not really been doing it for me. Just really have not. I have skincare, eye creams, moisturizers, all that kind of stuff basically just coming out of my ears because I've just been inundated with skincare. And it's kind of like, well, you got to be careful what you ask for because, you know, like last year, when they weren't doing as much skincare before they came out with their skincare box and all that stuff, it was kind of like, we want more skincare. We want more skincare. And now it's like, that's all I get. Sometimes I don't even get makeup and I'm over it. <laughs> so yeah, just full disclosure. I haven't been that excited to open my boxes. I don't know. You may have noticed last month, I didn't even open my box on camera. I just, I took a sneak peek and I was like, nope, both of my boxes. The stuff is not terrible. It's good quality products, but they just haven't really been sending me stuff that I'm excited about. It's like I'll see people opening up their PR boxes and stuff like that, and they get all the nice bomb palettes and good stuff, and it's just like, okay, so I might get that, and then I don't, and it's like, I'm actually paying for my box. Hello, <laughs> you know, and then it's kind of like, well, you can, you know, do the choice thing where, you know, you got to remember what date, make sure you get up on time, make sure you're in there early because when the choices run out, then you're screwed. And I'm just kind of over it. The whole chasing the dates and the times to make sure I pick the good stuff so I don't get the crappy stuff. It's just like, I'm over it. Okay. I miss the days when everybody used to basically get the same products, at least the same three or four base products with a variation here or there. So you basically knew what you were going to get except for a few variations. Now they have like 150 variations. And so it's just like a box of tricks. You don't know what you're going to get. <laughs> so anyways, that was my short little rant. Turned into a long little rant, but yeah, I don't know. I'm going to see what I get in my boxy looks next month. And if I'm not happy... I'm probably just going to cancel. I canceled Ipsy months ago because I was over Ipsy. And so, unfortunately, I'm starting to feel the same way about Boxy. But let's go ahead and jump into this box so I can just see what I got and let you guys know. <laughs> okay. So, first off, I see there's no card in here. So, I don't have anything giving me the information for these products, which I do not like. I don't feel like I should have to look everything up if you're claiming a certain um value for the box i feel like there should be a card in here but anyway let's start out with this first item this is from skin and co it is truffle therapy eye concentrate and this i believe was one of the um choice items if i'm remembering correctly so this is the size of the box let's take a look at this eye concentrate <laughs> it's kind of cute it's small look at this big box look what i pulled out of this box y'all this right here all of this see all of that packaging mm -mm. that's fraudulent okay <laughs> fraudulent because this is just unnecessary but anyways this is what the packaging looks like very very pretty and so this is what an eye cream eye concentrate truffle therapy restructuring eye contour concentrate so i'm not going to open this up because like i said i got a lot of skincare and i don't need to open up another eye cream because i have a million of them 
already open right now. So that's item number one. I also got in here, this is from Pure Heels. It says Centella 90, am, is it ampoule, ampoule or ampoule, ampoule? And let's go ahead and check this out. I've never gotten anything from Pure Heels. Ooh, that looks really nice. So this is what this looks like. Very nice. And it kind of looks, I don't know if you can see, but it actually looks kind of thick in there. It doesn't look like your typical watery type serum. So let's see what it says. It says soothing ampoule, which contains centella asiatica extract. It relieves irritations of sensitive skin and strengthens the skin barrier. Okay. Okay, nice. Sounds very nice. So I'll be trying that out when I get around to some new skincare. Also, we have in here from Sugar Rush, Tarte. Oh, okay, so I guess Sugar Rush is part of Tarte. I didn't know that. It says Sugar Rush Tarte Best Bud. This is what the packaging looks like. And it says that it's a lip butter balm. Okay. Oh, how cute. Very, very cute. This is what the packaging looks like. I like that little rose shaped top. Very, very cute. Let me see what this smells like. Oh, that smells good. It smells very sweet. Yeah, it smells like sugar. <laughs> but this is what it looks like. I'm not gonna use it because I don't need a new balm right now, but that's what it looks like inside. Okay, so next I have here something from Kat Von D. It still says Kat Von D on here. 24 hour super brow, long wear pomade. So this is what the packaging looks like. It's actually very cute, nice detailing. And let's take a look at this dark brown. So that is what this pomade looks like. So I guess I'll try it out. I don't know if it'll be dark enough for me because my hair is pretty much like black brown, but we'll see here. This is from Milk Makeup. It's one of their cute little stick products. And this says that it is a glow oil, lip and cheek. Okay, in the shade Flare. Now, I typically don't like stick products just because they're kind of tricky for me to use because I don't really do the whole dewy makeup look. So it can be a little bit difficult for me to figure out how to best use these type of products, but the packaging is really cute. So let me open this up and take a look. Okay, so it has a little plastic covering on there for safety, which is very nice. Yeah, so that is the color. That is what this is looking like. I'm not sure if I wanna try this out or not, just because of the fact that I really don't use this type of stuff, so I might just give it away. So I don't think I'm going to actually swatch it. Um, don't wanna swatch this. No, I'm not, because <laughs> I know I'm not gonna use this, so I'm not even gonna swatch it. I'm gonna give it away. And lastly, I have here this palette from Too Faced. It's the Natural Matte Palette. This packaging is really, really cute, very pretty. It just has this gold box that pulls out like this. And this is what this palette looks like. I think it's very, very cute. I'm trying not to blind you with my ring light, but I think it is very, very cute. I like this packaging. It's kind of like like a raised bubble type packaging and i like the color of it i think it fits the name very well natural matte it comes with this little booklet and let's take a look okay so there is a mirror in here and these are the colors for this palette and as you can see it's all matte and it looks like it actually would make a pretty very pretty neutral eye look. So I'll probably do a video trying this out because I'm curious of, you know, what type of neutral look I can do with this. So it's cute. 
So that's it, you guys. That is the last item that I got in my Boxy Premium for the month of May. Like I said, they send out some really great products, name brands, and things like that. It's just not stuff that I've actually been wanting as of late. So I will open my base box for you guys when I get it. Hopefully that'll be soon. And we'll see what happens with that Lux. Because, honey, if I don't like that Lux... I'm going to cancel, okay, because I'm over it. So, anywho, thank you guys so much for watching and hanging out with me, and I will see you on my next video. Toodles!